Uh, welcome to your virtual transition evening. We can't wait to get you in the building in September and get you into your lessons and into classrooms and really mixing with all the other students at the academy and we're really looking forward to that. Um, it's online at the moment but I hope it gives you a taste of what we're capable of online and the school has certainly learned some tricks over the last 18 months and I would say that our, techno our technological offer is actually very strong at the academy and something that we'll continue to improve on uh, over the years ahead. I'm delighted to see that so many of you are taking part in summer school. I think that's you know great if you can do that. Uh, well over half of you, which is brilliant. Uh, so you'll have kind of a week or two weeks for some of you where you'll just kind of get to know the place in an informal way. That should be a lot of fun. Uh, but if you can't make summer school, don't worry, because we will ensure that your first days, we really kind of take the time to show you where everything is, so that you're making new friends, and you're getting used to us. Now look, everybody, everybody, even myself after all these years, we're always a little bit nervous on the first day in September. No, 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 nobody more so than the year six is coming into year seven. But trust me, that feeling passes really quickly. Okay, it passes really quickly for most people. And what you'll find is, is that I think primary schools are brilliant. I think what goes on in primary schools is amazing for the age group that they teach. But as you're getting older now, you are going to want to start working with specialist subject teachers and working with lots of different people in the day. Uh, and, and that really, you'll, you'll notice that when you come to secondary school, a chance to really grow and become excited about subjects, uh, maybe even in a different way. So I'm really looking forward to that. And I know that will happen, okay? So you'll, you'll be nervous when you first come. There'll be a lot of new, you'll be meeting a lot of new people. Um, some of you will be, you know, won't be nervous at all. But I would like to think that everybody is like anxious to do well, anxious to have a good start. Uh, and then before you know it, you'll be settled in and you'll start to really fly in these subject areas. And you're, you're going to really enjoy being at the Sir Robert Woodard Academy. Uh, so again, brilliant to get to this milestone. Uh, sorry that we couldn't do it in person this time, but we will make up for it over the summer and in September. Uh, and it's a really important milestone in your life. And I'm looking forward to welcoming you. And I know you're going to have a great time here in September. Thanks very much. Good evening, Year 7. I'm Mr Scantlebury and I'm the chapter head for Dickens and Year 7. I'm really looking forward to meeting you all um, in September. I'm an English teacher at the Academy and um, I'm here in the school library. Two things that uh, I'm particularly fond of, reading and football. So I thought I'd film myself in front of our football fever display. So things I'm talking, looking forward to talking to you about in September. Um, I'm hoping to meet some of you during our summer school. Um, hopefully you are aware that we've got two weeks of summer school in August. So you can come in, get to know our school, kind of jumpstart your experience at SRWA. I'm hoping to get you into as many different classrooms as possible, different spaces, meeting different teachers and giving you opportunities to all kind of spend some time with each other. Um, I'm sure you've got many anxieties about starting here with us in September, having not been able to come in already. But please, please, please be reassured that we'll do everything we can to make your time here um, as positive as possible. And in September, we'll dedicate lots of time and energy into making you feel very welcome. Hello everybody. Hello you lovely Year 6s, soon to be Year 7s. I'm Miss Barr and I am your Year 7 uh, leader and this is Miss Westgate and she's your pastoral officer. We just want to talk to you. Such a shame we can't talk to you face to face but we do want to say hello and so you can see at least what we look like. So I've just got a couple of things to tell you. The first thing is Going back to the idea of our transition day that we were going to have in July, we're now going to have that the first day you come back, which is Monday the 6th of September. It will only be you, Year 7s, not Year 6s anymore, and you will be in the Academy with us. You will get to know your tutors, they will spend the day with you, so will the Year Group team, and we will have a day where we do all sorts of activities, no lessons, you'll get to know the building, you'll familiarise yourself, and you can ask us lots and lots of questions and we'll be happy to help you. You'll get to see who else is going to be in your tutor group. Miss Westgate's going to tell you a little bit about that in a moment. And uh, it will just make you feel so much better. And within a week, I guarantee you will feel that you've always been here. That happens every single year. A couple of other things I want to tell you. 
So our year group base, we are going to have a base. You're all going to see where that is on that Monday. And that is your go to place. So whenever you're upset, whenever you need to ask anything, whenever you just want to pop in and say hi, because we'd love that, then we're going to be there for you. Sometimes there may just be one of us. Sometimes uh, we're going to have to ask you to wait a moment. But that is your first point of call after your tutor group in the morning. because That's where you start your morning every morning. So I also want to flag up that we're going to have a meet the tutor evening for you and your parents, well mostly for your parents because you'd know your tutor by then, and that's on the 15th of September, that's a Wednesday, so that's one of the first dates that's coming up uh, a couple of weeks into you settling here, your parents will get the chance to uh, chat to your tutors and you'll be already have told them about uh, lots of things about the academy. So I can't wait to meet you very, very soon. I'm just going to hand over to Miss Westgate now. Hello, I'm Mrs Westgate and I'm the Pastoral Support Officer for Year 7. OK, so um, we've been really busy behind the scenes waiting for you to arrive. We've been organising you all into your tutor groups. We've arranged for you all to have a buddy, so you should feel really comforted when you come up. You'll have somebody you know directly next to you working alongside your tutor. So on a day-to-day -day basis, I will be in the year group office and you'll always be able to find me or Miss Barr in there. So, like we've said, we cannot wait to get going and I'm sure you feel the same. But if you don't and you feel a little bit nervous, that's perfectly normal and we are he here to help you every step of the way. So see you soon. We look forward to meeting you. I hope you feel excited after hearing from our Year 7 team here at SRWA. We're just going to take a few minutes now to talk through some of the detail prior to starting and what will happen in the next coming weeks. In terms of chapters, we have a chapter system here at SRWA. Um, ideally, students have been placed in the same chapter as their sibling where possible. The chapters are relevant for sporting and charity events. And of course, a big factor in the student's day is their tutor group. So their tutor is the person they see each morning. We have put students in groups based on the friendships that were recommended from the student's primary school. Um, so hopefully you'll be able to see a familiar face in the morning. If you're coming to us and you don't have any existing friendships or you're coming and you're the only person from your current primary school, then we've paired you up with someone else in the same situation so you can make lots of new friends. We offer a virtual tour of our school, so you can take a little sneak peek around our building if you haven't been here yet. You can follow the link here or go onto our website. We also offer a Year 7 handbook. This has lots of information regarding your September start. Um, it, it talks about transport, it talks about uniform, it talks more detail about our extracurricular activities. So please do take a moment to look through that handbook and get really excited about all of the opportunities. We use a system called Arbor. This is for all of our registers and all of our data that we keep on your child. You will have access to this account and you can go in and check that your information is correct as a parent or carer prior to the September start. In the next couple of weeks, you will receive a welcome email from Arbor um, and you can log on following that email. We are starting a new payment system in the school called Swift Pay. We are currently in the process of setting this up for the academy. It is a cashless system. Again, you will receive a welcome email from Swift Pay before September, telling you all the information as to how to get set up. Hi, I'm Luke. If you're feeling nervous about starting in this school, please don't. It's brilliant. The sports, activities and facilities are honestly incredible. You've got brilliant uh, 4G up there, which um, Chelsea play on, and it's just honestly so much fun. Hi, my name's Callum, and the teachers here are really supportive. They help you get along with stuff. Um, the Arsenal School Clubs are really helpful. They're great to make friends. The, sub the subjects are really fun, and so is the school. The X versus Y after school competitions are honestly great. It's really, really competitive and that's so much fun. It's brilliant for making friends and talking to teachers. My favourite subject is history, the teaching in it is really supportive. My favourite after school club is basketball and Mr Smith is really helpful as well. My favourite subject is PE because I just generally love sports and all the PE teachers are brilliant here. Hello, my name is Esme and I'm a Year 7 student at SRWA. Hello, my name is Hannah and I'm a student at SRWA. I've come up with some tips to help you from the transition from Year 6 to Year 7. My personal fear is not fitting in and not making any new friends. 
don't stress if you don't know your way around. I was very stressed on my first day when I didn't know my way around. But just find a teacher or another student that will be happy to help you. The staff here is absolutely amazing and I'm pretty sure your new friends will help you. If you need anything, go to your chapter head or your PSO and they'll, ha they'll be happy to help all of your questions. They are very all supportive, especially the SO team. And finally, number one, if you're scared that your teachers don't like you, they will definitely like you and I promise they'll like, you'll like them too. If you ever get stuck in this and don't be afraid to just put your hand up and ask for help. Hi. Hello Year 6 and welcome to Sir Robert Woodard Academy's Chapel. My name is Paul Summerson and I'm your chaplain. And it's going to be my privilege to welcome you and be a part of the team that supports you as you settle into this great school. Welcome to my office space. This is where groups of one or two can come and just chat and go a little bit deeper in conversation about some of the things that you're living with. So this is your space as well. It's just next to the Dickens office and the door's always open and you're very welcome to come and just share what's going on. So this space is yours. It's yours to come and be still, to find peace, to hang out with your friends, to have lunch here and just a place of calm and stillness in the busy life that is education. We have a heart for three main things through the chapel work. One is listening. You need to know that you'll be listened to. No matter what's going on in your life, in your head, and in your heart, we're here, I'm here, to listen to you. And to encourage you as well in the art of all good listening skills. Then we want to inspire you. We want to tell you stories about some incredible people who get up to amazing things that change small bits of the world, or indeed the world itself. And so we're going to tell you stories about inspirational people. We're also going to help you discover the inspiration that you are. And finally, we want to get you involved. We want to get you involved in things like Harvest Festival uh, and making a difference in your local community and indeed globally as you go through the years, the opportunities that are available. So it's going to be, I'm really looking forward to meeting you all in however it looks uh, come September. And I so look forward to showing you around all the things that we do here in the chapel. Take care. See you soon.